Welcome to Tutututute. In the mobile communications, we will discuss multiple choice questions. Discuss okay. So, the first question is A mobile phone uses dash type of duplex communication. Mobile phone uses dash type of duplex communication. Half, full, zero, both A and B. Mobile communication is no half duplex, ano, full duplex. Ano, no duplex, zero duplex. Answer is full duplex. That is two way communication. This is possible. Aitala, mobile communication. That is two way simultaneously. So it comes under full duplex communication. So uh, communication is uh, classified simplex, half duplex, full duplex. Simplex is one direction le matram communication, one way communication. Okay, one alle paraya matram, adte alle adu keka matram. Okay, that is two way communication alla one way communication. Next is half duplex communication. Half duplex communication orne two way communication ana, pakshe simultaneously alla. At a time one alle ana communicate ya. Okay, adte alle listener ana. Two way orne bo, pakshe enda where time will appear to me to communicate yeah. okay so it is half duplex communication it is a two-way communication but it was it is not a simultaneous communication full duplex duplex which two-way communication on a other world and other simultaneous in simultaneous communication on a other at a time two-way communication not another so mobile phone you say that uh, uses say the type of full duplex other than at a time two way communication simultaneously two way communication okay upon simplex half duplex full duplex number compare and again direction of communication simplex link in unidirectional one way communication on then half duplex number two directional on two way communication on but one at a time one time will you one way to mother communication and download okay Next is full duplex. Full duplex is two way communication or, or two directional communication simultaneously. At a time, two ways no, communicate. Next, send bar receive. Sender can, can only send data. Edhila, simplex. Le. Simplex is sender na, send yam matre batulu. Adhole, receiver na, receive yam matre batulu. When uh, for half duplex, it is Sender can send and receive data, but one at a time. Half duplex where you sender send and send and receive and receive. At a time, you can send and receive. That's not simultaneously sending and receiving. When it is coming to full duplex, sender can send and receive data simultaneously. Simultaneously, send and receive and full duplex. That's mobile communication. Performance. Worst performing mode of transmission is either simplex. Simplex is the communicate and receiving. That is the transmit and receiving. That is the one way communication. Matra. Better than simplex is either half duplex. Best performing mode is full duplex. We will mobile communication. Example simplex is keyboard and monitor. Keyboard that is the input. Kodukku. Upper the side will receive him. Other than that, our feedback on the Okay. Then walkie talkie. Walkie talkie in the rainbow half duplex. Anna. At a time, either it sends or either it receives. When it is coming to full duplex, the example is telephone or mobile communication extra coming under full duplex. Okay. Next, a full duplex communication is a dash way communication single, two, multiple. On or all the above. That is what we will discuss. Two way communication is either um, full duplex communication or two way communication. Aana. Paging system uses which mode of transmission? Paging system is mode of transmission. Aana, you see it is uh, given options of full duplex, simplex, half duplex, and duplex. The answer is simplex. Okay. Paging system allows for one way communication to large audience paging system engena oru communicator undav adu kore communi adayathu oru transmitter allengil oru data transmitter undav receive cheyan kore systems undav adayathu oru sender um kore receivers um so it is a one way communication 
paging system allows for one way communication to a large audience. So it is a simplex type of communication. Next is in cellular network frequency spectrum are divided into discrete channel, non-discrete channel, class of frequency, none of the above. In the uh, cellular communication, le, frequency spectrum divide in the, it is based on discrete channel. Discrete channel site on frequency spectrum divide in the. Okay, so the answer is discrete channel. Next is dash are added to geographical cells of specific area. Cellular technology, le, or a geographic cell in the, in the uh, frequency spectrum divide, uh, divide in the, it is divided as discrete channel. Discrete channels are added to geographic cells of a specific area. Oro cell in a lingual oro specific area ke, oro oro channel light on a assign chain other. Right. So answer is discrete channels. Next is the process of transferring a mobile station from one base station to another is. Process of transferring a mobile station from one base station to another is. Cellular technology, along with cellular architecture, we have to discuss cells in a particular mobile stations, that is, base stations in a particular discuss. Then, question is the process of transferring a mobile station from one base station to another is called. It is MSC, ROM, handoff or forward channel. That is, handoff is a process, right? In cellular telecommunication, the term handover or Handoff refers to the process of transferring ongoing call or data connectivity from one base station to other base station. One base station na adutha base station leke one mobile station da controller transfer in the process. Aba ane the handoff alenge handover na varaya. When a mobile moves into different cell while conversation is in progress, then MSC mobile switching center transfer the call to a new channel. Belonging to the new base station. That is, call is on the cell in the where cell like a lingle or base station the party in where base station le party the like a pomb in the MSC. That is the mobile switching center in the controller at the base station like a transfer. That is the one in the handoff when a mobile moves into a different cell while the conversation is in progress, then the MSC transfer the call to a new channel belonging to the new base station. Next is mobile unit traveling through different cell enters different frequency allows a base station to take control is defined as a number of parna handoff in a letter. mobile unit travel in bomb or a base station a the puddhi cell like ano travel a the a base station like a control as in gm. Okay, our base station like a as in JM, our process in the barrier handoff and hand over the barrier. Next is the time over which a call can be maintained within a cell without handoff is called run time, peak time, delta time, cell time. That is the cell the time over which a cell can be maintained. One cell is maintain maintained, control maintained, maintained time. Within a cell, without handoff. Handoff process is not a kind. That is why we dwell time. Okay, the time over which a call is maintained within a cell without handoff is called as dwell time. Dwell time vary depending on speed of user and type of radio coverage. Next is the techniques are used, dash techniques are used by a user to share the spectrum in a in an efficient way. Dash techniques are used by a user to share the spectrum in an efficient way. Multiple access technique, frequently access techniques, rarely access technique, none of the above. A user ka techniques are used by dash techniques are used by a user to share the spectrum in an efficient way. Spectrum efficient way. La, Share and pala users who to share and obey in a technique. It is multiple access technique. Multiple access technique. For multiple access technique, 
തന്നെ മൊബൈൽ കമ്മ്യൂണിക്കേഷനിൽ മൂന്നായിട്ട് ഡിവൈഡ് ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് എഫ് ഡി എം എ ഫ്രീക്വൻസി ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് ഫ്രീക്വൻസി ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ എന്താ അവൈലബിൾ ആയിട്ടുള്ള ചാനൽസിനെ ഫ്രീക്വൻസീസിൽ ഡിവൈഡ് ചെയ്തിട്ട് ഓരോ യൂസറിനെ അസൈൻ ചെയ്യാം പിന്നെ ടൈം ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് ആക്സസ് ടി ഡി എം എ എന്ന് പറയുമ്പോൾ എന്താ ഓരോ യൂസറിനും ഓരോ ടൈം സ്ലോട്ട് പ്രൊവൈഡ് ചെയ്യാം അതായത് ഫുൾ ഫ്രീക്വൻസി സ്പെക്ട്രം തന്നെ എല്ലാ യൂസേഴ്സിനും എങ്ങനെയാണ് ഫുൾ ഫ്രീക്വൻസി സ്പെക്ട്രം എന്നല്ല സോറി ആ ഒരു ചാനൽ ആ സെല്ലിനെ അസൈൻ ചെയ്തിരിക്കുന്ന ചാനലിൽ തന്നെ എന്താ ഓരോരോ യൂസർക്കും ഓരോരോ ടൈം സ്ലോട്ട് ആയിട്ട് പ്രൊവൈഡ് ചെയ്യാം ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് ടി ഡി എം എ സി ഡി എം എ എന്ന് പറയുമ്പോൾ എങ്ങനെയാണ് കോഡ് ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് ഓരോ യൂസേഴ്സിനും ഓരോ കോഡ് പ്രൊവൈഡ് ചെയ്തിട്ടുണ്ടാവും ആ ഒരു കോഡറിൽ ആക്സസ് വരുന്നത് ഓക്കെ സോ ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് കോഡ് ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് ഇൻ വിച്ച് സ്പെക്ട്രം അവൈലബിൾ സ്പെക്ട്രം ഇസ് ഡിവൈഡ് divided and further this narrow base are divided equally into time slots time slot i to divide in then endha pariya it is time division multiple axis or tdma next is in which multiplexing technique different users are assigned with the different channels different users in different channels assign cheyina edila frequency division multiple axis le ടൈം ഡിവിഷനിലാണെങ്കിൽ എന്താ ഒരേ ചാനൽ തന്നെ പല സ്ലോട്ട്സിൽ കോഡ് ഡിവിഷനിലാണെങ്കിലും ഒരേ ചാനൽ തന്നെ കോഡ് അനുസരിച്ച് ഇനി ഫ്രീക്വൻസി ഡിവിഷനിലാവുമ്പോൾ എന്താ ചാനലിന് തന്നെ നമ്മൾ സ്പ്ലിറ്റ് ചെയ്തിരിക്കുകയാണ് പല ഫ്രീക്വൻസി ആയിട്ട് നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഇസ് വിച്ച് ഓഫ് ദ ഫോളോയിങ് ആർ മൾട്ടിപ്ലെക്സിംഗ് മെത്തേഡ്സ് യൂസ്ഡ് ഇൻ മൊബൈൽ കമ്മ്യൂണിക്കേഷൻ മൊബൈൽ കമ്മ്യൂണിക്കേഷനിൽ യൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്ന ഏതൊക്കെയാണ് ടി ഡി എം എ ടൈം ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് എഫ് ഡി എം എ ഫ്രീക്വൻസി ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് ആൻഡ് സി ഡി എം എ കോഡ് ഡിവിഷൻ മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ആക്സസ് ഓക്കെ സോ ഇത്രയാണ് നമ്മൾ ഇന്ന് ഡിസ്കസ് ചെയ്യുന്ന മൾട്ടിപ്പിൾ ചോയ്സ് ക്വസ്റ്റ്യൻസ് ഓക്ക